name is Brad Hartzig. I live in Longview, Washington. I like to come down to the Columbia River this time of year and see the sea lions, and I photograph them. And it's, uh, it's a pleasure to get this close to them and watch them interact together, and I really have a good time doing it. Hi, my name is Marco Whiteley. I live in Rainier, Oregon. And we're being uh, invaded by seals. And the seals remind me of the seals in Monterey where Steinbeck's friend uh, Doc Ricketts used to live in the book Cannery Row. Same noise, the same excitement. It turns you into a child again. You just wish they would stare, uh, stick around long enough for you to feed them like we did in Monterey. My, my daughter used to go crazy to feed the seals. So we like them here, they're noisy, but we just put some insulation up on the windows and we're good to go. Thank you so much, sir. My pleasure. We're from Vancouver, Canada. I'm Tim. Um, and we, we drove out this way to see these guys. <laughs> this is my first time ever seeing a sea lion before. Okay. First time ever? <laughs> yeah, yeah, wow. yeah. I've seen seals very far in the distance, but I've never been this close to a sea lion. Wow, so yeah. what do you think? They're amazing. They're so, they're so cool. They're beautiful and, and great. They're awesome. They're entertaining. Yeah, for sure. Cool. How would you feel if the if, if the port was to give them their own docks in here? Created docks like see how this little stretch over here? Yeah. Um where the sea lions, but bigger than that, could have their own. Imagine like ten big docks out there. That'd be super cool. That'd be great, yeah. We need to coexist amongst all animals, so giving them a space to be to live. 